Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Summer's Gone. We're at college. This is the first day, and we're going to go ahead and jump into the game. So, let's go. Oh, man. First day, and we're already late. You really have a problem, you know? I do? It's called an addiction. You can't go a day without these stupid rolls. Oh, wait. Yeah, those rolls. I remember those rolls. They're yummy. Don't judge me. Besides, there are no classes today. They're going to welcome us all first, but you might be in trouble. Why? You forgot to buy the official uniform. There was no official uniform? Other students confirmed it. Uh, that lady just walked by without a uniform. Yeah, and why isn't she wearing a uniform? Maybe she isn't a student. We'll see. Well, watch her be the only one in a uniform. <laughs> she is. She's the only one in a uniform. Where are the uniforms? Anyways, I'll be waiting at the auditorium. That's funny. She's the only one in the uniform. Hey, that girl looks familiar. Who's that? She looks familiar. The, the blonde one. The blonde one in the middle, I mean. Everybody's blonde here. Except for that girl. Um, I hope he's not in our class. We already have enough ugly guys. <laughs> well, that was rude. <laughs> that was rude. How dare you guys? They're all unknown people, so I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. I heard about Miss Marla being our new professor. I hope so. My mom knows her good. I'm sure I'll get some free passes. Hey, I'm Nami. We spoke over the phone. I hope I brought the right uniform. Oh, man, they set her up. They set her up. All these stupid girls set her up. Jeez. Yes, this is the right one. <laughs> Excuse me. This is the first day, and you're already in need of attention. W what? Detention after school. Meet me in my office. But what? <laughs> I don't know why she got detention just now. It, like, is there a strict no uniform policy? Like, or maybe, maybe they had her wear a uniform of a rival school, or maybe they made they made her do something inappropriate. Probably, we'll figure it out. Um, but I don't understand why. She looks fine. I mean, these girls are... Chonies are showing and everything. We'll figure it out. Man, looks big, but no one's here. I think it's our first day of college, and there's already these college kids and... I don't know, administrative personnel, like, picking on us. All right, um... Uh, Hey, mind if I sit here? Hey, wait, yes or no? Yes, I mind, or, or yeah, you could sit here. Yeah, I don't mind. Nice. My name is Trey. Nice to meet you. John. Okay, she's coming straight for me. What's going on? Okay, she's just going to come in here. like She's just going to scoot her butt right through here. Whoa. Of course. Yeah, of course she would trip. God, you saw me coming. Move your legs. What's wrong? Yeah, she just got picked on is what's wrong. I thought only the dudes got picked on. This is a nice change of pace where the girl gets picked on. Haven't had this game happen yet. I got detention. Why? I don't know. Hey, hi, I'm Trey. Hello, Nami. Oh, I see. <laughs> Looks like someone got you good. Okay, what's going on? Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. Your uniform's from a rival college. If you were a dude, you would have been beaten up by now. So, so we didn't need to wear uniforms? Oh, hell no. See? Oh, fuck off. See? Like, okay, how huge is Trey, though? He's taking up half the screen right now. Look, look, look at this guy. Definitely out of proportion. <laughs> he, doesn't work, he doesn't do leg day, though. Look at those chicken legs. There, that's Bella. She's a spoiled rich kid who gets away with everything just because her parents donate a lot of money. The Asian girl is Ayu, or however you say that name. <laughs> She's a bit weird, but not that bad. But she's a parasite, always on Bella's ass. And this is Nadia. She doesn't speak much, always reads and stuff. 
She also has a reputation of being impenetrable. Huh? Huh? There we go. That's the right way. You ask her out, there's a 100% rate of failure. I don't know what's wrong with her. Okay. And who's this guy? In a creepy dark voice. Is he talking to Trey? Hey, sweetie. Are you in for a good time? Bro, what's up? Jeff. Jeff, where were you? We got the bitch, dude. Miss Marla. I know, fuck. Oh, where are my manners? My name is Jeff. Nice to meet you. John. Madam. I'm Nami. You're a cute redhead. Thanks. You feel his eyes analyzing you. Hmm. What? What do you say, Trey? Huh? 35? 35 to 40? Yeah, that should be enough. Stare at them, ask again, look away. Uh, I'm going to ask again. What's going on? What? 35 to 40 pounds, and you're on the team. What team? Sports. The sports team? Like what? What sport? You're too skinny right now. You need some muscles. Yeah, we need some new players, you know. Uh, you know, I'm not really into sports. I see that. Meet me at our gym. We've got one on campus. Uh, okay, sure. Why not? I mean, I may as well get to know people. Like Nami said, I need to be social. Awesome. I'll make you the next Ronnie Rockle. I don't know who that is, huh? <laughs> the German bodybuilder. Yeah, I doubt it. Can I come too? No. <laughs> he probably just said it like, no. Oh, poor, poor Nami. She doesn't have any friends. They were picking on her. I'm joking, of course. It's an official college gym. Everyone who's attending this college can come. Oh, good. John, you want to go shopping for some gym clothes today? Uh, I have... Good. Hey, I haven't said yes. You two are a cute couple. Okay, she said that weird. He friend. <laughs> I friend. Okay, why did she say it like that? What? Oh. Okay, that was weird. She said that really weird. Okay, all right. I'm very confused by her. Uh, uh, why? What happened? Miss Marla. I know. We're done. I I'm so com I'm so confused by what's going on right now. Yeah, I already got in trouble with her this morning. Oh, who are you? I'm Nami. I am the one and only Mila. And you? John. I'm glad you aren't wearing a trench coat. You look like someone that was shoot up a... Oh, leave him alone. I see who's wearing the boots in this relationship. We're friends. Why does everyone think that we're in a relationship? <sighs> oh. Weird conversations, ladies and gentlemen. Uh oh, here's this one crusty ass administrative person. Every freshman, except two, should be here by now. I am Miss Marla. And I'll be your teacher in most of your courses. And she is way over there on the other side when there's only two to four. There's like five people here total. I'm pretty sure she's still mad about me disarming her. Oh! Oh, that's the lady from the car. The other car. Yeah. I already met a few new students. Sadly, some of them are in desperate need of attention. Oh my god. <laughs> well, now for the history of our school. Most of the room size. An eternity later. Thank God we're missing all that. And everybody's asleep, it looks like. <laughs> uh, uh, even John fell asleep. Ugh, I must have slept through it. 
Everybody passed out. Are you kidding me? And what is going on here? Is this all new students or, or what? Okay, what's... This is weird. It's very weird. I'm not okay with Trey. Uh, sleeping on my shoulder right now. Trey looks like a weirdo. And that's why we use the color blue. Huh. All right, here she comes. About to wake us up. Now, follow me to your classroom. The primary course will be held there. And your secondary course is in a different room. This is the hallway to your main classroom. Classroom 4D. Let's sit together. Uh, sure, why not? Whatever. All right, let's say, uh, all right, let's sit next to the window. Yes. All right. Okay, Trey looks a little bit more proportionate here. It looked crazy when I was sitting next to him. Then I say you can sit down. Um, I don't see anybody sitting. I don't believe in a student's ability to choose their own seat. Oh, okay, I guess we're not sitting next to each other then. I'll assign the seating. All right, what a bitch. Trey, you sit here in the first row. Oh, man. And you sit next to him. Iowa, next to her. Jeff, there. Bella, next to him. Oh, please, no. Don't argue with me. Two students can't be here today. One of them will sit next to you, Bella. Uh-oh. You. Oh, look at that ugly face. <laughs> that is scary. You, there. Nadia next to him. And where is Mila? Uh, I have no time for this. And the other absent student is sitting next to you, Nadia. Yes, that's fine. I don't know what she said. What is, uh, okay. All right, calm down with your hips there. Now for the rules. Smoking or any kind of drug use isn't allowed on campus. Sexual activity will not be tolerated. Some people don't have to worry about that. She looks, oh, she's, oh, you're looking at me? What? Confidence derived from ignorance. If you disrupt a lesson, you'll be punished. Follow my rules and we'll be okay. Violate them and you will be punished. You're free to go now. The first lesson starts tomorrow. That was a, a quick first day. I guess just orientation, huh? Nami, see me in my office for your detention. That's rude. That is so fucked up. Bitch. What did you just say? I didn't say it to you. My office, now. Okay. No one treats her like that. Let's go, John. Let's kick her ass. Oh, wait, we're gonna go, we're gonna go talk to these girls. But they even think that John's a, like a weirdo. Hey, stop right there, buddy. Out of my way. Don't be stupid and attack her up front. You would regret it. I don't regret. Think about your friend Nami. What do you think would happen to her, bro? Bella isn't a rational human being. Crazy and unpredictable. He's right. Calm your balls. What's wrong? Is our school angry? Shut up, Mila. Wow, wow, wow. Come, let's go for a walk. She grabs your hand and drags you to the door. Hey. I don't know what's going on here. This game is kind of weird. I'm not following 100%. We'll figure it out, hopefully. I love the start of summer. The warm, gentle breezes. They always remind me of my childhood. Okay. Do you like summer? Oh. I don't know. I do. And I'm leaving. No, please stay. Here, take one. No, a cigarette, huh? Is she trying to get me in trouble? Or are we just, we're going to be the cool smoker kids? We're the kids that go outside and smoke when we're not allowed to. 
tell me about you. Hmm. All right, sure, whatever. Let's uh, let's talk. I recognize a broken mind when I see one. Oh, she's one of those girls that likes to fix people. My mind isn't broken. You're right. It's shattered. She takes a long drag. You remind me of someone. A girl I knew from high school. Always trying to look normal. Nothing weird about her except that certain aura. Blood aura. An aura that... <laughs> that scares me. And I have that aura? Yes. She killed herself a few weeks after graduation. And you know what's the worst part of it? In a bored tone. Mm. I knew about it. I knew that she was having issues. I saw it in her eyes. I felt her inner conflict. But I didn't do anything to prevent it. I didn't trust myself. I thought I, w I, thought I would annoy her if I speak to her about it. And now she's dead. And where are you going with this? You think I'm going to kill myself? No, there are different types of dealing with it. And you look like the type of person who'd prefer to hurt others. I might be wrong, and you'd prefer to kill yourself too. But just keep in mind, there are people you can talk to. Okay, uh, let's joke with her. Let's see, what, let's see what this says. I'll keep it in mind when I shoot up the <laughs> Okay, all right, she took it as a joke, that's good. No, but for real, keep it in mind. You're free to go now. Okay, thanks, teach. <laughs> safe zone? This says safe zone right here, but it looks like the edge of a cliff. All right, who's saying hey? Who's this girl? I can't remember who this is. Oh, this is the girl. Um, isn't this the girl that was at the hospital? Oh, hi. My roommate wants to see you. Why? She didn't say. Okay. Um, thanks. But don't do anything that might hurt her. Okay, why would I, why would I hurt her? She's probably paraplegic now. Anyway, we're going to see her in the next video. So thank you so much, everyone, for uh, hanging out. If you liked the video, make sure you smack that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.